Yeah, we've done this Audrey squat now, and we're about to give a performance. And Val is our leader. And perhaps you can just tell us a little bit about Bell Place and um, how you got involved with it, for example. Yes. Well, I first heard proper handbells, which um, are played in generally church groups, uh, a long, long time ago, about 25 years ago. And when I found out how expensive they were, oh, yeah. I gave up all idea of um, having any. Yeah. But uh, when my husband and I retired, as a present, he bought uh, a set. What a fine gentleman over there. Looking on studiously. Yeah, it's fine. Um, the bell plates are about a tenth of the cost of the handbells, but they sound very similar. Yeah, just give a demonstration. This is one of the basic notes, isn't it? Yes, this is the lowest note that we've got at the moment, yeah. but there are lower ones. Um, you just play them like yeah. that. And again? That's fine. And if you have a little tiny one, such as this one, Yes, this is one of our higher bells. There we are. And, and we all follow music? Yes, we all, all follow music, mostly staff notation, but yeah. some of it's written out, the names of the yeah. letter names of the uh, notes. Well, there's the two different types, isn't it? There's real music, but Val has marked in the player in this position when they have to play their bell. Or you have it in different tone. What do you call this? You call this a kind of um, what notation is this? Um, it hasn't got an official oh, name. Right. It's just the letter. Because each bell ha or bell plate rather has um, the name of the, of the letter on it. Yeah. For example. Right. Yeah. And we get charts and well, we don't have flats. We just have normal notes and sharps and sharps. Charts. And sharps. Yeah. But we've got all the um, notes that you find on a piano yeah. for about three and a half octaves. Yeah, three and a half octaves, huh? Oh, yeah, just under three and a half yeah. octaves, yes. That's good. And we all sit around this, a table such as this, and we've all got to watch for our spot. <laughs> this is some of our team members getting into position. As yet, there aren't many uh, residents come to here, but... Uh, Oh, that will start soon. Some, some of you, uh, we had seen and played two before, but uh, if um, you haven't seen these things be played before, they're called bell plates, and we are the bell plate team, uh, there's eight of us, and uh, we're trying to entertain you with Christmassy music and carols. Um, we hope you enjoy what we've got to bring to you. Um, you can sing if you like, but we're only going to do one, one verse of each of the carols. Okay. Thank you. We're going to begin with We Wish You a Merry Christmas. Which I know it's a bit early, we still do wish you a Merry Christmas. And excuse my back, but I've got to look at the music. And they've all got to look at me. <laughs> one, two, three, one, two, three.
come all your faces. I can see. That to the soup. Mm -hmm. and these bells, um, most of us stick to the same two each time, but we have to swap them around the table from time to time. Hang on. which I'd never heard before until we started learning this one. It's called Jolly Old St. Nicholas. Has anybody, no. have you heard that one? No. Well, I don't know the words for it. <laughs> but you can sing to, um, to uh, Jingle Bells. We, we, you hear Jingle Bells several times through it, and we, we um, then break out into Jolly Old St. Nicholas, which is um, quite nice too. <laughs> Trying to decide which but which uh, hand to put the extra bell in it can get confusing. We play three bells. You see, we thought to have a third hand, really, but we haven't got the third hand. So do they all play different notes? Pardon? They all play different notes, do they? Oh yes, yes. Well, that one's um, F. That's G, which I normally play, and this one is half. Whoops. This one's halfway between, and you only need it sometimes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't remember what I'm supposed to be doing. Right, yeah. that's better. Right. Well, when you get to, um, when we start off with Jingle Bells, sing, but when we get to Johnny Old St. Nicholas, no words, I'm afraid. One, two, three, four.
one you've probably heard many, many times. It's uh, Little Donkey. Does it come from um, Harry, did Harry Belafonte sing yes. it? Yes. Right. Well, think of him as you sing it. Sorry, wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> Need a long arm for this game, passing bells down the table. Right, little donkey. Away. And each little bell has got a plastic cover to protect it with the right ident on it. You must make sure we've got the right ident on the right bell. And they sit in their little box like that. And if we're lucky, we get a cup of tea and sometimes a sausage roll. <laughs> 